Last week we talked about Palm Sunday and the profound details and great lengths that God the Father went to to adopt us as his children. So let's pick up where we left off. After the Passover lambs were inspected for four days and found spotless, starting on the evening of Passover, the high priest would sacrifice the lambs and then at 3 p.m. the next day, when the last lamb was killed, the high priest would say, it is finished. Now, after Jesus went into the temple and was questioned for four days and found blameless, he celebrated Passover, which we call the Last Supper. And then that same night, he was betrayed and handed over to Pontius Pilate, where he was tried and tortured all night and then handed over to be crucified. He was hung on the cross the next day, and at 3 p.m., he yelled, It is finished, as he breathed his last breath. As soon as he died, the curtain in the temple separating the people from the Holy of Holies where God's presence was, tore from top to bottom. So on Easter, Jesus was both our perfect and final Passover lamb and our high priest. He saved us from death and he offered us new life and his blood became the door to access the Holy of Holies to God's presence. So now both of us, you and me, Jews and Gentiles alike, are able to be God's children. Isn't that amazing? So that's what Easter means to me. It's my gotcha day and hopefully it's yours. Happy Easter, everyone.